it's an honor to be representing Center Unified School District this evening. I'd like to not only take an opportunity to thank Evan for your wonderful introduction, but I'd also like to acknowledge my appreciation for our superintendent, Dr. Kevin Jolly, and our assistant superintendent, our director of personnel, as well as our vice principal at Wilson C. Riles, <laughs> Shelley Hoover, and uh, I have been fortunate to also to have members of the school board and members of our faculty. So I want to thank you very much for celebrating this honor with me. <clears throat> As a professional educator, I've been blessed to have been able to teach an extremely diverse group of students. I've had the pleasure to teach students who will, given their intellectual ability and academic background, have the greatest likelihood of enjoying success in their future endeavors. I've also been fortunate to be able to serve special needs students and at-risk students in mental health, criminal justice, and special education programs. The common thread that joins these experiences has been the fundamental principle that special needs and at-risk students should receive an education that will make them equally successful in life. Our school motto is, success the only option. Throughout the district, this credo is reflected in the commitment that is at the heart of the district's educational practices at every grade level and provide a range of instructional and support programs. Over the course of my teaching career, the demands on teachers have become more onerous and made bringing this credo to fruition seem too daunting a task at times. Like most teachers, as difficult as these demands have become, each and every day spent with my students is a growth experience. The daily challenges these demands present have taxed my vitality. The desire to enrich the educational experiences of my students tests the limits of my educational acumen. The stewardship for preparing my students to face an uncertain future full of challenges humbles me through my awareness of my own shortcomings. However, through my attempts, I have received the greatest gifts my students, like Evan, can bestow. They have helped me appeal to my higher nature in my educational practices, but most importantly, they've helped me become a better teacher and a better person. Thank you.